Welcome to a trainee video on the Genome XRQ system. Genome is a dedicated chemiluminescence imaging system delivering simplicity and sensitivity. A simple setup process means it's easy to capture a high quality image of any western blot. Welcome to this short tutorial on how to capture a chemiluminescent western blot on a Genome XRQ system. Using Genesis software you can capture images of your specific application either automatically or manually. For the purposes of this tutorial we will capture the image automatically. From the home screen select Blots and then select between Chemiblot Single Image and Chemiblot Series. For the purposes of this tutorial we will pick Chemiblot Single Image. From the Dye Selection page Select the chemiluminescent reagent that you are using. This is very useful for reference purposes. For this tutorial, we'll select ECL. A nice feature is the ability to capture a visible marker, which is automatically overlaid with the chemi image. To capture a visible marker image, check this box. When happy, select the green arrow to go forward to the sample positioning page. To ensure you have your sample in the correct position, turn on Happy White Light. A powerful feature is the auto expose area, which is particularly useful to use if you have bright and faint bands on the same blot. This feature allows you to get a quick preview image of your blot to help you position the yellow rectangle over the area of either. your faint bands or you can choose to use the area outside the box and exclude any bright bands. This is particularly useful if you have a bright marker which you'd like to exclude this area and focus on your proteins of interest. If you just want to check quickly for the absence or the presence of protein, move the slider bar towards faster speed. This will use binning. If you're looking for publication quality images, move the slider bar over to higher definition. This will use less or no binning. Using auto capture means that you will never saturate your image, which is useful for quantification purposes. You can save your setup as a protocol, which will be present on the home page. Saving a protocol can save you time and it takes you straight to the sample positioning screen. The histogram shows you how many grayscales have been captured. A 16-bit camera is capable of capturing over 65,000 grayscale level levels. Once the image has been captured, it can be saved as an SGD, a TIFF or a JPEG. The image can also be edited and annotations added using the edit screen. For analysis, simply use QuickQuant or export to Gene Tools. Hope this short video has shown you how simple it is to capture publication quality images of your Western blots on the Genome XRQ system. For further information please visit www.syngene.com or follow us on Twitter or LinkedIn.